Alright, so it's day two of the gym vlogs. Today I'm going to be doing a leg and shoulder workout. Now, the routine is slightly out of order because my friend Tom isn't there to film it on Mondays and that's when I do chest and triceps. So usually the routine goes, Monday is chest and triceps, Wednesday is back and biceps, which by the way, if you've not seen that video already, make sure you go ahead and check it out. Um, and then also Thursday is then legs and shoulders. Now if I was going more times a week, then I probably would spread it out a little bit more. I do calves basically at the end of Monday's workout and the, the end of Wednesday's workout. But yeah, I can't do chest and triceps at the moment, so I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna do that. But anyway, enough said, let's get straight into the workout. All right, so we're nearly at the gym now. We're gonna be doing a leg and shoulder workout. Five leg exercises and then three shoulder exercises. Let's go in, let's get after it. So the first exercise I'm gonna be doing is for the hamstrings and that's gonna be back extensions. Now obviously back extensions work your lower back, but if you lower the sort of front panel down slightly below your hips, it does work your hamstrings in there, just make sure you squeeze them. I really wanted to do deadlifts, but my friend Tom didn't want to do them. He did say that next week we would definitely be doing them, so hopefully he keeps that promise because I'm sick and tired of doing these. But anyway, I did these for four sets of around 10 to 12 reps. Here I'm doing leg curls which is another exercise for the hamstrings. This is going to isolate the hamstrings though. Now hamstrings are the weakest part of my legs so I am on a really light weight for these but I'm doing a whole five sets so very high amount of sets and I'm doing about 10 to 12 reps of so very high volume for these. Obviously in the leg routine I have got to include squats in there, it's a really great exercise. Here I'm doing a warm up set for the squats and then I will be moving up to a heavy set which I will do about 6 to 8 reps with. Now for squats I do use the Smith machine which I know a lot of people are against using but personally the Smith machine allows me to go to failure which I prefer doing just because if I'm using a rack I always find it a struggle putting the bar back on the rack especially when I've not got a spotter which obviously Tom is filming me so I've not got a squatter for this. <laughs> Moving on to one of my favorite leg exercises and that's got to be leg press. Now this is going to isolate those, well not isolate the quads but it's definitely going to work the quads a lot more than the hamstrings. So for this I'm doing three sets of 12 reps now. I've really improved on this exercise out of all the leg exercises so I'm really happy with this one. Finishing off the legs, I'm doing leg extensions just to isolate the quads. Now this I'm going a lightweight just to really pump blood into the muscle more than using a super heavy weight. So I'm doing three sets of this and again about, well actually I'm doing about 15 reps for this one, so high amount of reps. Finally moving on to my first shoulder exercise, so for that I'm doing dumbbell shoulder press. Now this is going to work the front portion of the delts, so for this I'm using a weight I can manage about 10 reps with and I'm going to be doing that for a whole 4 sets. Oh. 
Shoulder 21s is the next shoulder exercise now. Shoulder 21s basically I'm going to be doing 7 front raises, 7 side raises and then I'm going to be doing 7 rear delt flies. So I really like this exercise because it's almost like a 3 in 1. You get to work 3 different sections of the delts, the front delts, the side delts and the rear delts just in this one exercise which because I'm doing leg and shoulders together it is a little bit time consuming as it is so this just helps me uh, to get a lot more into the exercise. I'm finishing off the workout with upright rows. Now what I like about these is obviously they are going to be working the shoulders but they also involve a little bit of the traps which I don't do any specific trap training in my workout and so by doing this it allows me to get a little bit more trap activation I also do this with the bent over rows which I showed you in my back and biceps routine so for this exercise I'm going to be doing three sets of 12 reps yeah. all right so we're here at the gym meet the crew this evening Jonah, he goes to my church, one of my main <laughs> friends, and then we've got wherever he is, He's Sam right somewhere, who's one of Jonah's mates, but I don't have a clue where he is. Alright, finished with the workout, legs and shoulders, so just want to say, make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it, and make sure you subscribe for more content, and also if you've not seen my back and biceps workout already, make sure you do so, I'll probably leave a link in the description, something like that. That's pretty much it, see you later, goodbye. Go when you're ready. Alright, so oh, I can't, I need to turn it out. Like, yeah. It's in the. Oh, I'm back. <laughs> Did that. Baby, baby, baby. Oh.